beautifully pointed feet. Look. Yeah. Oh, it's a... Well, they look like statues, don't they? Yeah, well, they look part of the painting. They though. do, yeah. Right, Mum, I've got a really beautiful dance performance up for you next, and I know it's really going to suit your taste because you love dance performances. I it's do. called Zhizi Qinglu, and it's inspired by a painting that is called Qian Li Jiang Shan Tu. So this painting was by a painter called Wang Qimeng, who lived in the Northern Song Dynasty, and actually finished painting it when he was 18. Huh? The English name for it is A Thousand Miles of Rivers and Mountains. And really tragically, he passed away at the age. So today's performance, Zhizi Qinglu, is based all on this painting and inspired from it. Let's take a look. Right, here we go then with the beautiful dance performance, Zhizi Qinglu. Just based on that painting. Thousands of miles of mountains and rivers. And what I hope you'll find from is that the colours and the dance performance kind of very much relates to that painting we talked about. Oh, you can kind of see that it... Yeah. I'm taken by a big hair to start with. That's yeah. a big bun. <laughs> Can you see it looks like the painting in Chen Li Jiang Shan Tu? Yeah. Oh, there's more dancers now. Yeah. Yeah, the hair is very high, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, all of them look. <laughs> so I guess this is the handful of the Song Dynasty, which was around 1100. It's about yeah. just under a thousand years ago. Oh, I love the fabric and the colours. That's so stylish. I think this is a nice handful. We did a video the other day on some Tang Dynasty handful. Yeah. I prefer this though, I've got to say. It's, it's a bit more simple. It's, so, it's very elegant. It's very elegant, minimalist. Yes. Like jade earrings as well. So, Zhizi Qinglu is like everything green. So I feel like this is also a representation of like nature. Yeah. You have the green and the blue of the water and the land. Makes me think of green mountains and bamboo forests and, and water. Water, yeah, the, the rivers. Yes. The movements are very like staccato but flowing at mm. the same time. Very flexible. Sharp movements. Oh, it's lovely. Honestly, it's hypnotising, isn't it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I wonder if that's a cool drone in the background. Oh, the stringed instruments. I like this music. Simple but so effective. Yeah, it's quite a modern dance performance, isn't it? Oh. It's excellent choreography for sure. And it's not ballet, is it? It's not a traditional know. form of dancing, it's a it's a really cool modern blend. It's like quick movements and yet it's so flowing. <laughs> yeah, sometimes yeah. I wonder if they've sped the camera up. Oh! Oh! oh. <laughs> Incredible hit. Yeah, yeah. Flexibility. If 
you were wearing green and I've got blue on today. <laughs> Look, it's like the reflection in the water, that's clever as well. It must be a shiny oh, yeah. surface you can. Look. Mm. movement a sideways bend. No little steps. Oh, she's gorgeous. She's so elegant. Very striking, isn't she? Extremely. Very, very attractive. <laughs> that looks almost <laughs> unnatural. <laughs> Be able to bend that far, <laughs> and hold it. Look, look. No, that would be back breaking for me. <laughs> oh, it would be great to be in the audience and see that. Mm. The attendees of this one way. Some really big artists. They're using their arms and their sleeves to really get it. Yeah. I, I think this is, in terms of choreography, the best dance we've ever watched. I know we've watched the ones under the water um, and where they're flying, which is obviously impressive, but that's not just choreography is it, it's using engineering to help them do unnatural movements. But in terms of pure visual performance of a human body, yes. Are you going? this is this is the most artistic for me, it's the most sophisticated. I did really like that one underwater, but the reason that was impressive is because it's underwater. Also this has no real backdrop to it. It's all about the dance. It's a really refined performance that is just completely and utterly focused on the movement of the body. Look, it looks like the painting now. Oh, look, it oh, looks like look. the painting. <laughs> that is the painting. Tragically, he passed away at 23. Yeah. Often great artists are like that though, don't they? they that can be. They do have a tragic end. Oh, look at that. Beautifully pointed feet. Look. Yeah. Well, they look like statues, don't they? Yeah, well, they look part of the painting. They do, yeah. Right, Mum, that was the incredible dance performance, Zhizi Qing Lu, based on the inspirational painting, Qian Li Jiang Shan Tu. What did you think to it? Oh, that was just gorgeous. I think that was the nicest dance routine it was so well choreographed and the music and the way that it fitted that ancient um painting painting yeah. was just yeah, yeah awesome it was almost a bit emotional like i said in the video i think it's the most refined sophisticated dance performance we've seen oh and i just wanted to say i also felt a little bit scared by it because some of the movements they did would break my old western unflexible hips <laughs> but that aside we want to wish you a happy new year and